Hello everybody and welcome back again with World of the Final Fantasy. So apparently we need to go capture the Ifrit and Shiva because I don't have them in my group. And so to do that, so you have to go to the Colosseum. How can I help you? And this is where they are. So I think that's Ifrit right there. And we gotta find Shiva somewhere up in here. Whoa, the ultimate weapon. Dang, look at that thing. That thing is level 90 and 85s. Yeah, I ain't doing that stuff. I'm on level 45 here, people. Alright, I think this is it. Let's begin. So we'll find out. Don't let your guard down it's just because we're stronger. Down. Sorry, but this might not end well for you. Alright, let's do Cerberus. See if Cerberus can help us out. Not even. Ah, I just realized something too. Whoops. Yeah. Predictable. <laughs> ah. Oh wow. I can't believe I just did that. Well uh, post done. to capture them and not do it that way. Come back soon. Alright, let's go way back in again. Let's begin. Alright, so I'm guessing you're gonna have to use fire upon your it. Watch out, was right. Come on, get back into your Final Fantasy Pokeball. Oh, come on. Although I totally know what I could call this um, video, maybe. Fire and ice. Finally get effort? Yep, we finally got effort. It's about time to now we gotta get this chick. Hopefully she isn't much of a pain as the other one. Come 
Yep, alright, cool. We got uh, both well, Ifrit and Sheila. For our story that we need to do. <clears throat> So we got those that we well need to do. Done. All right. And the next thing we have to do. Farewell. Well, first we put these guys away. Seraphine out, that's strange. Maybe we go talk to her. But in order to talk to her, I can just go straight over here and talk to her that way. Do you mind if I ask you something strange? Huh? Like what? Am I correct that you're in charge of controlling the gates and managing our prismariums now? What do you mean now? Please. <laughs> you know full well that this pixie has always been in charge of both. I can't carry the prism case everywhere we go, but we can access it from safe locations. Alternate and you're the timeline one who returns sucks. to Nine Hills when we fall in battle? Huh? Well, yeah, sort of. I have to use the return crystal Anna Crow gave me, which unfortunately means we have to come back to Nine Wood Hills every time. Hold on a second. This is strange. <laughs> with the sudden barrage of questions. Oh, I guess I just like to go over things now and then. Huh? You serious? I guess that means most of what I know about Tama applies to Seraphie in this timeline. As long as I remember that, I should be able to play along. Okay. That was weird. There was some girl here the other day looking for you two. I didn't recognize her, but she was holding a teacup. Anyway, she said you two have been given the power to touch the souls of many. So you should stop by and visit her at your earliest convenience. Oh, but uh... Sorry, she didn't leave an address. <laughs> well, it's because it's that door right over there, Seraphine. Which now we know what quests I have to do for this too. There's five quests. <clears throat> Apparently you Shall have you can what sort now? it out. Who's so Alright. Yeah, because it's by level, complete first, and incomplete right here. So it's these ones right here. But apparently if you complete every single one, there's going to be a quest right after the Clash of Swords. is like an optional quest. And you gain a trophy for it too. <coughs> but let's find out what's going on with these Moragas. So it's been that long. None of us know exactly how long it's been, but it's estimated the giants who lived here must have disappeared about a hundred years ago. A century. Huh. It's a little hard to imagine. Well, why don't we head back to the airship and... Wait, do we actually find Bahamut, Bahamut? Oh, snap, we do. <laughs> Was there something I could help you with, Bahamut? Oh, or should I call you Tia Babalo? Tia Babalo, what the hell? You dare speak my true name before a stranger? Have you lost your mind? <laughs> what is going on? It's been a century, you said? Been quite a while. But I used to know old Bahamut here. You know the Dyad Servant? A servant? Me. Dude, this guy's cool. <laughs> You once served Lon and Rain. Oh yes. Who can forget those two? <laughs> what? Lon I gotta Rain get this guy for a pet if I could. The Heralds. 
probably Seguaridus. Must have concocted the name to spice up their crimson prophecy. But there's a basis to it. The original Azure prophecy mentions demons too. <sighs> Did Rain and Rain know? Could they have read it? Rain always was a Yes, she was. Except I like how they did the, uh, the design for this guy. You know, you're kind of <laughs> taking all the wonder out of my childhood here. One thing I know, no one would have started calling them the Demon Dyad or whatever if you hadn't been there, acting like demons and wreaking havoc against their will. You can blame the heralds for that. How long I was sealed away? How dare Grandalus name his army Muhammad? I know, right? It's, it's weird. King of this world. Is that the reason you're here? Listen, I've observed Brandalus up close for a century, and... Tia Babalo. Face it, you don't stand the slightest chance against him. Oh, snap. Hey, he has a rocket on him. I trust you've heard of them. They're a fusion of three things. An esper like me. A human. And lastly, a god from the extraverse. Gods from the extraverse? Espers? What are those? Well, the Azure Prophecy makes mention of them both. Essentially, it says, From oblivion, light and dark were born. Light begat beings called Espers. Dark begat monsters. And humans who sought the light. In the Extraverse, the world that surrounds ours. So I guess these five quests that I gotta do are for these... Dyads. That are beings and non-beings, and will not heed reason. One world found a tear in the fabric, and exploited it to confine espers inside their human bodies. However, this tear left them open to the extraverse and its cruel god. So then does that mean the heralds are those exact same gods? I can't say anything with real certainty yet. In the end, the prophecy is just words, so the best we can do is venture a guess at what it means. In fact, it's because this first section was so ambiguous, it was omitted from copies. Only direct descendants know it. Then, that would make you... Yes, that's right. The first summoner's descendant. Oh, and probably the last giant summoner, I would imagine. Wait, she was the Although, first? Oh. It seems that some of you have picked up the art of summoning in our place. You'll keep it alive. Enough! I know, right? I agree with that. That Brandalus has become an X9 knight! Yes, that's right. A being who, just like in the prophecy, has crossed dimensions. In a way, what else can you call him but a god? He's completely different from the Brandalus that you think you know. You can't beat him. You can't even touch him. Ah! Bahamut's pissed. This cannot be! What you say is impossible! It doesn't matter what Brandalus is like now. He's not me! I'm the true king. The Bahamut king! Tia! Tia Babalu the Great! <sighs> Great. I wonder if that's really his so name. Tia Babalu. Wh why are we fighting? He needs to get some anger out. I mean, come on. Why not? What the? Uh... So the demon diehard thing... That was talking about us, huh? Yeah, I kind of figured as much by now, to be honest. <laughs> Rain. This is it. My past, if it's as much of a train wreck. Oh wow, nice, and he is an XL as well, dude. But well, he doesn't like light, that's for sure. Luckily enough, I came just prepared for that one reason of having light. Anger management. I need what? Oh, also, they were still you talking. Whoa. About messing with the heralds. It's true. You can't win. Then I shall just have to slop you in order to prove just how wrong you are. <clears throat> all right, Lon. It's all up to you, buddy. I say you kill it this time. Do 
2,000 damage. Aw, oh, I'm out of MP. <laughs> That's funny. What can I do, Thunder? Uh, it resists. That sucks. It's not like I'm doing much for physical damage either. Well, I could also do some ethers on him. Uh-oh. We know what that countdown means. Yep, that's not gonna be good. Gotta heal and fast. Three. Mega Flare. I knew it. You're making me really mad. Uh, yeah, I can see that. Mega Flare. <laughs> awesome. But it didn't do much damage to me, so haha. -ha. Now, if I didn't have defend on, then yeah, that would probably be a different story. <clears throat> what else was this guy weak to exactly? Nothing, actually. It's just weak to uh, light. I don't think I have any light type spells. Nope, nothing actually. That sucks. Barely even damaged it, too. Holy smokes, makes me wonder if I should have actually leveled up before I did all of this stuff, too. Spellstones will do anything to them at all. I know I got a couple of them right here. Yeah, it does a little bit, but not by much. Nice, I actually had some mega elixirs too. Okay, 
do we have any protect stones? Yes, I do. Uh oh, here we go again. I think I am going to be using up all my uh, stones. We just can't use earth though. to defend. Let's see what fast forward Mega Flare looks like. Didn't hurt me as bad, but it still hurt. Almost had a game over there. Oh, knackle. a few thousand damage before it goes into Mega Flare again.
Alright, final one. <clears throat> At least it didn't hurt that much. That's good. I think I still had haste on too. So close. Dang. Ooh, I got lucky there. I don't like this boss. That I do not. Two. Well, it's about what, 40, wait, I would say about a good 40%. Not getting easy. Yeah, I still can't summon any champions. That's not making any sense. <clears throat> Do I have any elixirs? Oh, I did. That'll help. That's right, you do that. And I can feature your butt.
No, we don't need to protect. Hey, I like that. Items are actually doing more damage than what it should. Well, cool, I like that better than spamming all my MP. Still hurt. Again? something here. For some reason I can't do a um, Phoenix down there we are. beat this guy before he does it again. And this is just the first one. I hate to see what all the other ones look like. percent health. Now we gotta defend. Nice, I can summon that guy again. That's good. So we'll do that next round. I don't think she, I think she's dead. Nope, she lived. Good, good, good. Fan, and then we'll summon Terra. Oh, 
Well, that helped for some damage. And then she can cure. Out of items too, that's the worst part. Alright, hopefully this is the final attack. Nope. He lives. Don't know how. There we go, wow. Holy smokes, Bahama is a pain in the ass. Leveling up didn't do anything. <clears throat> yeah, he is the true Bahama, that's for sure. Can't be. When did you ever gain such strength? <laughs> From the shop. Yes, <laughs> but we must be more powerful than before. This is like our second go at this, right? Hey, Tia Babalo. You know, we're planning to fight Brandalus. If you come with us, you can have a shot at him. Tia? <laughs> now that I've lost, I have no right to refuse. I'm yours! Sweet. <clears throat> Can't wait to see what he could do in fights. Did we actually defeat him? A dyad servant? Huh? Huh? Oh. How about that? Lon and Rain have just taken their servant back. What? Lon and Rain are here? How is that? I don't know. But that's a good question for when I see them. <laughs> Whoo, man. What abilities has he got? Well, Flare, Mega Flare, Dispelaga, so that's pretty cool. And look at all that Strength Plus and HP. Yikes. <clears throat> I don't know, guys. That was pretty hectic. Looks good. Now we just got our first um, Diod Servant done, everybody, and that's where I will conclude this video because that was a pain in the butt. <clears throat> I can tell that I really got to level up. Being 53 doesn't mean nothing in Final Fantasy these days. So if you like the video, <clears throat> please give me a thumbs up and let me know what you think about the um, two boss fights that we had against the Shiva and Efrit and now Bahamut. So, as you can tell, we need to get a lot stronger because these mirages are getting really powerful and I'm having to rely on items and that's not a good thing. So please be sure to also check out my links that I have down in the description below. I'm always posting a whole bunch of stuff on Instagram and Twitter. So until then everybody, see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.